My name is Courtney, and I'm a driver. In fact, Courtney McRae Alston makes a living driving. I drive rideshare for Lyft, I drive Amazon, and I drive Instacart. And her mode of transportation? I drive a Chevy Bolt. It's a really fun car to drive. More than that, the electric vehicle uses zero gas, which translates into big savings. When I first started driving, I started driving as a rideshare driver, and I was driving about three to 400 miles every day. And I was spending 250 to $300 a week in gas. It was just so much money, and I said, there's, there's got to be a better way. This is crazy. Courtney made the choice to go electric two and a half years ago. She bought a used car for $25,000 and saved about that amount in just over a year. For someone who's driving just to work or something, they're not going to see it that fast, but it's still, you're not going to be using gas. It's much cheaper to charge. Switching to an electric vehicle is one of the best things you can do for the environment, for climate change. In the Northwest, it's the equivalent of driving a car that gets over 100 miles per gallon. Jeff Allen is executive director for Fourth Mobility, advocates for electric and smart transportation. He says EV use in the last decade has grown exponentially. According to the Oregon Department of Energy, in 2010, there were 148 electric vehicles registered in Oregon. By 2020, there were nearly 32,000 zero emission vehicles on the road. And nationwide in February, um, electric car sales were double what they were last February. Um, and there was nearly 4% of all new cars sold in the entire country, which is pretty remarkable growth. And unlike years ago, when the cost of buying an EV might have been a deterrent, nowadays they're much more attainable. EV prices have gone down as the cost of manufacturing batteries has decreased and production has scaled up. You can now get a new EV for about $30,000 and a used one for less than $10,000. Plus, there are rebates and tax credits. At the federal level, there's a $7,500 uh, tax credit available on most models. And at the state level in Oregon, we have a rebate of up to $5,000. The bottom line, EVs are only going to get more popular and more affordable. I love talking about driving an EV because I think that it's such a benefit to so many people. And I think that it really is the future. Keely Chalmers, KGW News.